This is a guide on how to self-apply the SMI cold compression foot and ankle wrap. Uh, we have two gel bags we're going to place into both of the slots here. Um, one thing I do to make things a little easier is I'll take the hook and I'll just fold it back up on the back of the strap. That way it doesn't get stuck onto other areas of the pouch while we're preparing it. Uh, just makes things a little bit easier. And get that other gel bag in there. So we want to go around a smaller area. So definitely want to, you know, make sure that the gel bags are nice and soft and moldable. So we do our little manipulation here, if need be, depending on how long it's been in the freezer. So first we're going to start with the dorsal application. So we want to hit the top of the foot and this part of the ankle. Uh, this strap in the middle is here, depending on if you want to hit different areas of pain. In my case, I kind of want to both of these to be together. So we're gonna fold that little strap in and just get these around. So this is going to go around nice and snug. Uh, if you're wearing a post-op boot, this is where the compression straps come in handy as it's going to effectively push the cold through. And as I'm wearing shoes, we can feel it uh, going through. Uh, so with this one, uh, even though, you know, if I have my, you know, crutches, uh, you know, I'm able to get around with it. But in this case, I'm still putting the compression straps on snug so that we can get that cold uh, in place. I'm going to adjust this a little bit more to hit this part of the ankle. So really, it's just a matter of placement. So I'm going to do more of a diagonal approach here. Or we can take a, this strap and strap it right onto the other like this. Almost so like it becomes one piece. Next, we'll look at how to apply to the other side. So this way, I like to say take the back of the heel and place it where that little uh, strap is on the back. All right, we want it to go right around this part of the ankle. So I'm gonna wrap that around this way and then this underneath. Wanna come around and under just like that. So now I have the cold pushing in this way and from underneath and eventually it's going to penetrate that whole area. When we're done, we want to make sure that we remove the gel bags and place them back into the freezer so that they can be refrozen. Um, or grab the other set of frozen gel bags if we want that continuous application.